First qualifier, paint till you faint, sea wind coast. Victorian Ramio, pink knees and tell you no lie. They're off and pacing with pink knees going right to the front with paint tell you faint, tell you no lie, sea wind coast and Pictonian Ramio onto the opening eighth, pink knees on top with paint tell you faint sitting second, tell you no lie is third, fourth, sea wind coast not the back, Pictonian Ramio. On to the first quarter, uh, pink knees on top, paint tell you faint. Tell you no lie, Sea Wind Coast and Pictonian Ramio past the opening corner. It's still Hello. pink knees. Paint tell you faint. Tell you no lie, Sea Wind Coast and at the back still Pictonian Ramio. First quarter and 31 and one with pink knees opening up a good few lengths on Paint tell you faint. Tell you no lie, Sea Wind Coast and Pictonian Ramio. On to the half. It's still pink knees. Paint till you faint, sit in second. Tell you no I is third. Fourth is Sea Wind Coast, not the back. Pictonian Ramio. On to five eighths. The half was in 103 and 2. Pink knees is still showing the way with Paint till you faint, sit in two. Tell you no I is third. Fourth, Sea Wind Coast, not the back. Pictonian Ramio. On to three quarters. P pink knees still showing the way. Paint tell you faint on the is on the rail in second. Tell you no lie edging out in third. Fourth is Sea Wind Coast, not the back still. Pictonian Ramio. Three quarters, one thirty four and two. It's still pink knees on top. Paint tell you faint. P no, tell you no lie. Sneaking through at the rail now. Sea Wind Coast, not the back still. Sea Pictonian Ramio. Through the stretch. It's going to be pink knees in the first qualifier. Paint till you faint second. It's going to be Sea Wind Coast for third, fourth. Tell you no lie. Off stride in three, four, five is, C is Pictonian Ramio. Mile on 202 and four. Second qualifier, Judy's Beauty, eventual leading. Under Sky Daily, Glen Gal Cam, Lady McCardle, and MD Joey. They're off and pacing. Judy's Beauty right to the front with MD Joey. Glen Gal Cam, Under Sky Dilly. And eventual leading and Lady McCardle now taking over the five hole past the opening eight Judy's Beauty shows the way MD Joey is second Glen Gal Cam third under Sky Daily way in four Lady McCardle in fifth at the back eventual leading on to the opening quarter Judy's Beauty on top MD Joey tightening up the pocket with Glen Gal Cam under Sky Daily way in four back fifth to Lady McCarl, not the back, eventual leading. Past the opening quarter in 31 and 4. As they hit the 3 eighths and onto the half, Judy's Beauty still on, still shows the way. MD Joey is way in second. Glenn Gal Cam in four, 3. Under Sky Dilly way in 4. Pressuring on the outside, Lady McCarl. Back trailing is eventual leading. Just past the half, Judy's Beauty on top. Lady McCarl on the outside, pressuring. MD Joey Way in third now. Under Glen Gal Cam is fourth. Fifth is under Sky Deal and at the back still. Eventual leading. Past the half in 104. Flat. Judy's Beauty still shows the way. Lady McCardo on the outside. MD Joey third. Glen Gal Cam. Under Sky Deal and at the back still. Eventual leading. Past three quarters now. Lady McCardo sticks ahead in front. Judy's Beauty now sitting two on the outside. MD Joey pressuring from three. Glenn Gal Cam is fourth with Under Sky Dilly. 
And at the back still, eventual leading. Three quarters, 135 flat. As they hit, ready to hit the top of the stretch for the final time. Judy's Beauty, Lady McCardle. Back to MD Joey, Glengal Cam, under Sky Dillion at the back still. Eventual leading. To the stretch, it's going to be Lady McCardle, Judy's Beauty, and MD Joey. 206 and 1. Third and final qualifiers ready to go. CL Crest Lakota, Caviar Mason, MB Casey's Comment, RL Rocco, Au Revoir Balboa. They're off and pacing with Au Revoir Balboa going to the front. CL Crest Lakota at the rail, Caviar Mason, MD Casey's Comment, and RL Rocco trails on to the opening eighth. Orvoa Balboa shows the way. Seal Crest Lakota's on top. They're sitting second. Caviar Mason is third. Fourth, MD Casey's Comet. Fifth, RL Rocco. On to the opening quarter. Orvoa Balboa tightening up the, from two. Seal Crest Lakota. Caviar Mason's way in third. Three. Fourth, to MD Casey's Comet. Back in five, RL Rocco. On to three eighths now. It's still Oliver Balboa, Seal Crest Lakota, Caviar Mason, MD Casey's Comet, and RL Rocco. Quarters in a good 30 and 3. To the half now. Oliver Balboa, Seal Crest Lakota, Caviar Mason, MD Casey's Comet, and RL Rocco. Past the half and on to five eighths. Still Oliver Balboa, good half and 102 flat. Seal Crest Lakota set in second. Third to Caviar Mason. Away in four. MD Casey's Comet. And Orfwa Balboa still at the back. On to three quarters. Orfwa Balboa. Seal Crest Lakota. Caviar Mason. MD Casey's Comet. And RL Rocco. Past three quarters. Orfwa Balboa. Tightening up again in two. Seal Crest Lakota. Back third to Caviar Mason. MD Casey's Common edging out in five. RL Rocco on to seven eights, three quarters, 133 and one. Opening up, Orvoa Balboa on Seal Crest Lakota on the outside. Try to take over three is RL Rocco through the stretch. Orvoa Balboa will win it. Seal Crest Lakota up for second, up for third. RL Rocco. Mile and 203 flat. Field six here in race number one. Uh, lining up behind the gate has one mischievous banker, Poker McCollum. Two, MM Lass, Hollis White. Three, Elm Grove, Fonzie, Henry Smallwood from four. That's Bonafide Success and Carl Eisner. Five, your Sweetwater Binky, Dave Carey. Outside six comes Sammy Stern, Todd Trites through the stretch. The first of the 2011 live racing season here at Troll Raceway. And they're off and pacing. Sammy Starr and Sweetwater Binky from the far outside crossing over quickly. And into the first turn, Sweetwater Binky grabs the lead inside outside. Sammy Starr now. Todd Trite says go. And Sammy Starr clears to the lead by the eighth mile marker. Getting away second. And that's Sweetwater Binky third. And at the rail is MM Last four. Trying to find a post. Along the rail is bona fide success. Closing that off inside five, mischievous banker. Your trailer to the only quarter. 
Is Elm Grove Fonzie by that opening station and Sammy Starr, the pace setter, by two. Opening quarter, 32 seconds even. Second is Sweetwater Banky, another four. Back to bona fide success. Outside five now and rolling comes Elm Grove Fonzie. Five at the Royal MM Lash in your trailer. Mischievous Banker, they swing in front of the grandstand. First time your pace setter is Sammy Starr for Todd Troy. Second, a little closer now of the helmet is Sweetwater Binky outside third is the Fonzie Elm Grove that is four inside bona fide success five to the five eighths turn is MM Lass and Mischievous Banka continues to trail the field they're halfway home 103 and three and Sammy Starr opens it up down the backside now by three second Sweetwater Banky another three lengths third is Elm Grove Fonzie. And we go back to four. He is bona fide success as Elm Grove Fonzie made a break in the three hole. And your trailers are M.M. Lass and Mischievous Bank. Uh, by the three quarters, Sammy Starr won. 34 and four by the three quarters. Opens it up now by seven, eight. Lance as they swing on by the seven eights. 2011 racing season. Opening dash. Looks like it's going to be Sammy Starr as he's got them by ten or more now. Off the top turn, the driver to the wire. Todd Trites and Sammy Starr under no urging. He's a statue sitting in the bike here. Race for place in this one. Second inside. He'll go to Sweetwater Binky outside. Third bona fide success. Fourth will be MM last. Time of the mile. Last quarter. 30 and 2. Race winning trip. 2 all. 5 and a 1 for Sammy Starr. Race two from the top of the stretch, as she did it for fun. Darren Crow, Dia Harlaka, Dave Carey, Jack Peach, Kirk Ferris, Demi Nimitz, Robert Laffin, Beer Drinking Pro, Ernie Laffin, River Kane, Bernard McCollum, Pearl Noir, George Venison, through the stretch. Here they come. And they're off and pacing off the gate. Five wide. Ernie Laffin sends beer drinking pro crossing over. Trying to grab the lead from Darren Crow. And she did it for fun. As they race by the eighth mile marker, Ernie Laffin now on to clear. And go down to the pylons here with beer drinking pro. Getting away second. She did it for fun. Sitting third. That's Dia Harlaka. Kirk Parrish down the wood for Deminis from five. Uh, that's, for me, that's... Ernie, Kirk Paris with Jack Peach. Robert Laffin has Deminis sitting five from six. River Kane, your trailer. Pearl Noir, single file. They race by the opening station. 30 and three-fifths. Beer drinking pro. Your pace setter for Ernie Laffin. Second on his helmet. Uh, that is she did it for fun. Racing third is Dia Harlaka. Action from the backfield now as Deminis and Robert Laffin strike the first over move, but he'll grab cover now as Dave Carey pops into the three hole with Dia Harlaka. By the half, the race four in, three out to the five eights turn now. And Beer drinking pro continues to set the fractions. Half Halfway home, 102 and 3. Outside second to a saddle pad now. Comes Dia Harlaka. Inside third. She did it for fun. Second over, fourth. That's Deminis. Five at the rail is Jack Peach. George Renison sending a pearl on the wire. Three high now as we speak. And your trainer, River Kane, they bunch up to the three quarter mile station and beer drinking pro. And by a neck up the rail outside second, Dia Harlaka. Three wide. Uh, that's pearl on the wire. Three quarter stepped 134. Darren Crow is going to need some racing room, but she did it for fun. Two and a half lengths separate this seven horse field off the seven eighths turn. Beer drinking pro. Ernie Laffin's going to work on the front end. And and George Renison under no urging at all here at Pearl Noir. Grabs the lead now on the outside. She did it for fun down the rail outside. And coming Deminis to the wire. Pearl Noir to win it second. It looks like Beer Drinker Pro third at the rail. She did it for fun here in race number two. Your winner, Pearl Noir, race winning trip 2 0 top four. of the stretch has Newcomb Ocean, Hollis White, Beer Drinking Blue, Ernie Laffin, Pictonian Sunshine, Dave Carey. Odds on design, Todd Strait. Skinny Sun, George Renison, six, Windermere JJ, Robert Lavin, outside seven, Paxkey, Kirk Parrish through the stretch. Race number three, here they come. 
And there we go. Quickly off the gate. Boss Pictonian Sunshine. Do outside. He is odds on design. As Todd Troitz hustles odds on design. Right up. Grabs the lead and quickly opens it up by three. Lance on new commotion. Sitting second. Third. Yep. The rail. As the race by the eighth mile markers. Beer drinking blue. Four. Inside, Windermere JJ, outside five, getting a parking ticket is Pictonian Sunshine. Six inside, he is Paxky, your trailer a little steppy there, skinny sun is the race. On by the opening quarter, odds on design, had them there by good opening quarter of 28 and four, and she shows the lead by four open lens. Second is New Commotion, third at the rail. Uh, that's beer drinking blue from four. As they swing off the turn in front of the grandstand, first time, Windermere JJ from five. At the rail, Pictonian Sunshine. Then we go back another four lengths to Paxky. Outside seven now on the move, but still steppy is Skinny Sun. The race to the five eighths turn, halfway home. Odds on design had them there in 58 and three. Second, trying to keep pace. Four lengths back is New Commotion from three. Inside, Beer Drinking Blue. She nods to the outside. And to grab that cover will be Windermere JJ. Back stretch, three quarters, the next stop. And Todd Troitz and Odds on Design now by six. Open Lance. Second. Inside, New Commotion. Outside, third, not advancing. That's Beer Drinking Blue. Four. Sneaking up the inside is Pictonian Sunshine. Three quarters. One, 29 and two. And Odds on Design has everything her own way off the seven eighths turn. She's got it by seven, maybe eight now. As they drive off the turn, second. Here's New Commotion outside third. Bear drinking blue. Pick Tony and Sunshine. Tries to sneak down the rail, but through the stretch, right down to the wire. It's going to be out. Odds on design second here on the outside. Looks like Bear drinking blue third. It'll be New Commotion. Race winning trip here in the third. A good one. So Two minutes. Life of Crime, Ernie Laffin, Extreme Editor, George Renison, SGL Fantastic, Henry Smallwood, Harem Queen, Kirk Bears, top of the stretch, and here they come. They're off and pacing. First one out of the gate is Life of Crime, followed by Extreme Measure as they head on towards the opening eighth. Asterix Duracell will have grabbed the three hole. With FGL Fantastic sitting four. Fifth is Port Hill Howe and out the back. And sixth, Harem Queen. On to the opening quarter. It is now Extreme Measure showing the way. Life of Crime sitting second. Asterix Duracell is third. Back fourth to FGL Fantastic. Then Port Hill Howe and at the back still, Harem Queen. Past the opening quarter, it is Extreme Measure on top. Life of Crime will get second. Sitting third is Asterix Duracell. FGL Fantastic is away in four. Poor Hill Howe is sitting fifth still at the back and six. Harem Queen past the opening quarter in a good 29 and three. It's Extreme Measure showing the way onto the half with Life of Crime sitting second. Pressuring him on the, from two, three is Asterix or so. Back to FGL Fantastic. Poor Hill Howe and at the back still. Harem Queen on to five eights. It is still. Extreme measure from the rail in two is Life of Crime. So on the outside is Asterix Duraso. Back to FGL Fantastic. Pressure on the outside and fifth is Port Hill Hound still at the back. Harem Queen on to three quarters. The half was in one minute and four fifths. So it's still extreme measure showing the way. Life of Crime still sitting second at the rail. Asterix Duraso is third. Back to FGL Fantastic and Port Hill Howe moving now. Still at the back is Harem Queen. Three quarters, 131 and 1. Opening up two lengths is Extreme Measure over Life of Crime. Hitting the top of the stretch, Extreme Measure on top. Life of Crime sitting second. Port Hill Howe pressuring from three. As they hit the top, come down the stretch, it's going to be Extreme Measure. Port Hill Howe gets second. Life of Crime is third. Mile and two oh one and three. Race five from the top of the stretch, two thousand claimers for purse nine seventy five has Mr. Down East, George Renison. 
Magic Ombre, Pooker McCollum, Tools Forge, Darren Crow, Boo Gurney, Ernie Laffin, PH Zero, Robert Laffin, Air Electric Sun, Dave Carey, Outside Seven, Maya Papaya, Todd Trites for the stretch. Here they come. And they're off and pacing in the middle of the gate. Bust Boo Gurney inside of him, Magic Ombre to the outside. As the race into the turn is PH Zero into the first turn. And Magic Ombre inside. Outside, Boo Gurney and Ernie Laffin will put Boo Gurney right onto the lead. Getting away third at the pylons is Maya Papaya. Another four lengths back and four to Mr. Down East from five. Uh, that is Tools Force. Another three lengths to P.H. Searle in your trailer. By the opening station is Electric Sun, your pace setter. On the front end now is the give and go works for Pooker McCall. Magic Ombre is your pace setter opening quarter 29 and 2. On his helmet second. Uh, that's Bull Gurney from three. Amaya Papaya. Closer four now. And maybe even looking to the outside. That's Mr. Down East. But Darren Crow has Ross Tools. Tools forced to the outside floor now. Grabbing that cover. Six outside. P.H. Searle. Your trailer is Electric Sun by the half. Pooker McCollum and Magic Ombre, your pace setter. On his helmet second is Bull Gurney, halfway home, 101. As Magic Ombre continues with the lead, now up on the outside second comes Tools Force. Third at the rail, that's Bull Gurney, outside four, P.H. Searle, five inside. As they race to the three quarters, that's Maya Papaya, outside six, Electric Sun, your trailer. You'll have to sweep them back there, and seven is Mr. Down East. On to the seven-eighths turn, Magic Ombre by the three quarters, one, 32 and two. Ernie Laugh in the world mean racing room, and it looks like he'll get it momentarily here. Bull Gurney at the pocket, and he pops. Third, fading, and outside. Side is Tools Force off the top turn. The drive for the water inside. Magic Combre going to work outside second. Here comes Boo Gurney and Ernie Lavin through the stretch. Right down to the wire. It's going to be Boo Gurney in front by two. Second, Magic Combre will need a photo for third here in race number five. Race winning trip here in the fifth. Good one, 2-0, two, oh, two and four. Field for race six here in the hands of the starter. Last chance for a pair mutual wagering. Top of the stretch, race six, has leaders first, Todd Trites, J.K. Down, Kevin Pinkney, Rumble Cheeks, Dave Carey, River Liella, Kirk Paris, Nia Motion, Emmons McKay, outside six, Lady Gigi, Robert Laffin, top of the stretch. Here they come. And they're off and pacing four deep into the first turn they race. And Todd Trites quickly sends leaders first out for rail control here. Second, filing in there is J.K. Down. Third outside is Ray Riliella. Getting way fourth at the rail is Rumble Cheeks from five. Another three lengths back. Deny motion. Your trailer. That's Lady Gigi. Back stretch. Single file. Now they'll race. Your pace setter is leaders first for Todd Trites. Sitting second is J.K. Downs. Third at the rail now is River Liella. Four. As they race to the three eighths turn, his rumble cheeks opening quarter. Step 30 and one. From five. Oh, that's Deny motion. Your trailer. Is Lady Gigi as they swing off the turn, make the way in front of the grandstand for the half mile marker. Your pace setter is leaders first, sitting quietly second. Is JK down outside third now? Quickly on the move comes Rumble Cheeks trying to grab that cover outside. He is Nia Motion inside five to Lily Ellen. Lady Gigi steps to the outside now. They'll race in pairs to the five eighths turn. And the breather goes to Todd Troitz and leaders first. They're halfway home. One out, two and one. Outside second. Uh, that's Rumble Cheeks. Third at the rail. Is J.K. Down getting the second over till fourth outside? He is Nia Motion. Five inside. Riviera. Your trailer is Lady Gigi. Three quarters. What's well, the next stop? Leaders first. Continues with the lead. It's down to a half a length now. Outside second. By the three quarters and 132 and one is Rumble Cheeks. 
third. Inside, J.K. down. Outside, four is nine motion. Lady Gigi will have to swing three deep off the top turn. The drive for the wire. Todd Trites looking for the three-bagger here. Leaders first. Quickly now he pops it open by two and drives on home. Leaders first. Wire to wire for Trites here in the sixth second. It'll be Rumble Cheeks third to J.K. down. Last quarter of 29-4. Race-winning trip of 2-0-2. Race number seven, your feature winners over 8.50, handicapped. Lining up behind the gate has one wild, one wild night for Kirk Paris. Two, St. Lad's Dogwood, Ernie Laffin. Three, Just Feels Right, Tammy McKay. Four, Frisky Putnam, Carol Eisner. Five, Stars Example, Robert Laffin. Six, Outside, Putnam's Forest, Darren Crow through the stretch. Here they come. And there they go. They're off and pacing. St. Lad's Dogwood inside, outside. Stars example as they go through the first turn. Ernie Laffin has St. Lad's Dogwood on the lead. Getting tripped out second. He is going to be Stars example to a break. Sitting third was one wild night. They race the backside now. And Darren Crow says no, no to the three hole. And Putnam's Forest up now to challenge St. Lad's Dogwood. And he'll grab the lead as they step by the opening quarter. Putnam's Forest now clears to the pylons and has the lead. Second is St. Lad's Dogwood. Third, that Stars example. Opening quarter is put up 29 seconds even. Third is Stars Example from four. Yeah, that is just feels right. Further back five to Frisky Putnam. Back pacing and now stepping to the outside goes one wild night. Bias the first time your pace setter is Putnam's first, the free legged pacing machine. The show's the lead. Second is St. Lad's Dogwood. Third, that is Stars Example. Another two lengths fourth. He is just feels right to race the 5 8 turn halfway home. 58 and 2. Your pace setter he is Putnam's Forest on his helmet second. He is St. Lance Dogwood grabbing on third. He is Stars Example. Further back four now to just feels right. Then we go back to Frisky Putnam and one wild night by the three quarter mile station. Putnam's Forest and Darren Crow are looking good on the front end. Second inside. St. Lance Dogwood three quarters up. One, 28 and one. And Stars Example now on the move. Second on the outside. Further back four. Dude just feels right off the 7 8 turn. And Putnam's forced by two and a half now as they swing for home. Second inside. St. Lance Dog with outside stars example. The Laffins will battle for place here as Putnam's forced under no urging wins it. Second will give it to St. Lance Dog with third. Stars example four just feels right. Time of the mile here in race number seven. One Watch closes Wednesday, Wednesday, April 6th at 10 a.m. Entry for the eighth, lining up in the hands of the starter. Last chance for wagering. Field of eight behind the gate. Eight entries here in your finale have Chapelet, Emmons McKay, NY Lotto, Robert Laffin, Lucky Acquisition, Todd Trites, Western Queen, Kevin Pinkney, Emily Down, George Renison, Race Me Volcano, Kirk Paris, Millie Camp, Tanner, Greg Monroe, Island Eagle, Dave Carey. Here they come. And there they go. They're off and pacing at the rail. Chapelet outside to join the hunt into the first turn. That's Lucky Acquisition. Getting away third neatly there. Into the three hole is Western Queen. Is Todd Trites puts Lucky Acquisition to the lead. Sitting second now is Chapelet. As they gap both probably by five on the third horse. Western Queen from four. Is the race to the opening quarter. Race me Volcano. Five. Is NY Lotto from six. That is Emily J. Down. Seven. Is Millie Camp 10 in your trailer. Island Eagle. Stretched out single foul to the 3 8 turn opening quarter. It's up in a quick one. 28 and 3 fifths. Lucky acquisition by two now. Over Chapelet. And then we go back to the third horse. It's Western Queen. Fourth. On that helmet is Race Me Volcano. Outside five now. Quickly on the move. Here 
comes Emily J down for George Renison. On to the 5 8 turn. Lucky acquisition had them halfway home in 59 seconds flat. Glued to his helmet second. That's Chapelet. Closer third now with every stride. Here comes Emily J down. Further back four is Western Queen. Three quarters the next stop. And Todd Trates has the whip up on Lucky Acquisition. Opens it up by two now. Second is Chapelet. Further back third by four lengths is. Emily J down, three quarters up, 130 and two. Looks like it's going to be two horse sprint from the 7 8 on. Rocky acquisition, sitting quietly second. Eel Chapelet off the top, turn third is Emily J down. Lucky acquisition. Here comes Chapelet through the stretch, right down to the wire outside. Chapelet gets up in the deep stretch, second. Lucky acquisition, third will be Emily J down, race winning trip. Here in the eighth, two all along. 